Hello friends. Do you like my sweatshirt? Abby got this one last night. Ashley got that one last night. Oh uh, yeah. This is it. It's Here. the same thing. But. I don't think we showed this. Um, but it says Issaquah Eagles established in 1901. We love this like purple, like uh, raised puffy, you know, really print cute. on it. Abby got this one last night. Um, you probably saw her wearing this one. She only got it because she was really, really cold and it's really cute. But she had to get um, a really large <laughs> sweatshirt because uh, that's all they had because they sold out so fast. And she got home and Anyway, she came into my room this afternoon and she was like, you can have this. I'm going to get a smaller one <laughs> when they um, get restocked with new ones. Um, so it was a very nice gift for Abby to give it to me. Um, so we are having a bit of a day. We are just all kind of under the weather, exhausted. But I did get one amazing video of your halftime performance. Yes, at your game this morning. So we got home last night and went straight to bed. It took a little while to kind of de decompress from all the adrenaline of the night. But then we were woken up by 7 a.m. alarms <laughs> to go to. I didn't wake up at 7 a.m. No, my alarm went off at 7 so I, so I could make sure that I got up in plenty of time. Like, I was planning to do my makeup, but I was like, oh, You're baby, like, I don't. I blush. <laughs> That's all I did. Normally I put like. So a it was a very, stuff. very early morning for us. We went straight to her, um, her game, and it was such an exciting game at the very end. <laughs> it was very. Um, shall I say non eventful until the very last minute of the game the score oh, was zero zero our game. your game was zero zero the entire game and we hadn't done the touchdown cheer at all not even close to having to we do were it like we, we were like we were gonna do it I thought we were gonna do it but they actually had the ball not us then oh, at the yeah. very end I was like wait wait I think they'll actually score a touchdown, and they did, and it was so two exciting. Games. We're the only one who's won two games. Yeah, their team is two for two, and so they're number one in our, you know, in their ranking so far. Um, which, yeah. if they keep going like this, you know Sky, that means no, we have. Skyline to, is. Oh, Sky, okay. Because Skyline's had more games than us. They yeah. started before. Us. Anyway. So we had a great time. They got to perform their halftime routine during halftime because it was technically a home game, even though we were not at our field, um, which was really exciting because it was good practice for them um, to kind of, we just created our own formation and I, it worked good, but we'll wait for the other um, choreographer from the high school to s tell us if there's any different formation um, that we should use. So I'm gonna cut to that. You guys can watch her little halftime performance. Again, you can't see the actual song. It's super cute. Why can't we? They bought it's a the copy song. But they they bought, bought the copyright. I didn't. I can't use the copyright. I'd have to buy the copyright yeah, buy license. It. So, um, but anyway, so we're gonna do that. Um, go do that really quick. Quick, watch her little routine. Um, they like also we, did a little. It's not like we have to watch it. It's not like no them. But then we also quickly did a tunnel for the boys. Um, they were just so amped up. They were so excited. Because the dude's been working on that play for... Yeah, the, we know the coach and his son is on the team and um, and he was like, you don't even understand. He's been working on that play. <laughs> and it only works in that one little setting and it finally paid off for him. So he, the little boy that made the touchdown was he so excited. He got like a belt, like a, yeah, their a little, wrestling belt. <laughs> yeah, their little MVP. Like we have a, uh, what, do you, what do we call it? Um, a spirit a, stick. A spirit stick. Um, but they have like a, this big, huge, like belt. Belt. <laughs> it's a, uh, wrestling belt. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so he got the little MVP award for his team and we handed out our spirit stick. Okay, so go and watch her little halftime routine. It is set to different music, um, but it's super cute and we'll perfect it over the next couple weeks of practices and then come back and, and we'll tell you what we're doing now.
finds it funny that like you're just like I have to cut <laughs> and now one second later for us <laughs> we're back with you what are we doing Ash so we're opening the gift we're opening this is right. well you've got to cover up the address her, well I was gonna cover her cover her address yeah I was gonna cover this her. came in the mail finally correct yeah she doesn't know what it is Came to our P.O. box. Can She's I been think? bugging me. Because you told me before. I know. I know. And then today, I have time. I've been tired. I took a two-hour nap. Um, but the USPS website was, was down. down. <laughs> She's like, I can't win. So I was like, I will come down here. We will check it. And then we got halfway here and we forgot the keys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah <come laughs> so it's been quite the ordeal. So, drum roll. What did Ashley get from Lynn? This is from Lynn. This is one of our, one of our viewers. Read it out loud. Oh, that one's for me. That's that's a note for me. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. Did you read it? No. I heard the, saw the first word. You saw the first word? <laughs> okay. What is it? Oh, that's cute. That's for me. The card is for me. That's super cute. I guess I, I should have opened that. I know that. what it is. Do you know oh what it gosh. is now? Yeah, I know what it is. I, I, just, it I think you just have to open it. Because it came from... Thinking. She ordered it somewhere else. Oh, it's like another one. Yeah, she ordered it and then mailed it to us. Oh, I know what it is. It's for the hoodie. <laughs> now do you understand? Yeah, I... Why we have to go get something else now? It's a bluey patch. It's a bluey patch. And look how cute he's gonna look on black. So now what do we have to go do? Go get a hoodie, but I already have one, don't I? You don't have a black one. You have the other, you have the NASA one on there. Oh. So we'll go get another cheap one from Hobby Lobby really quick. I don't wanna do that today. <laughs> she doesn't, you don't wanna go do it? No. Okay, she has a cold. She doesn't feel well, correct? Yeah. I just don't feel good. So <laughs> she wanted to come do this, but only because it meant home. staying in the car or running into the post I office. But me. can you tell Lynn thank you? Thank you. And we will get this. Uh -huh. um, maybe I'll run in really quick and go get one for you. Okay. Or dad tonight. Dad, dad is also it. sick. He's on his way home from work. And... Um, He's we canceled our game night tonight. He's like, I don't feel well. I need to rest. We don't have church tomorrow. I mean technically we do. It's a big conference for our you know, people larger group of people and we're just not gonna go. <laughs> we're gonna rest, we're gonna recoup, we're gonna sit in the rain and the thunder. It's supposed to thunder and lightning tonight. And um we're just gonna have a rainy um chill weekend. I also fell this morning and landed smack dab on my knee and it doesn't hurt it's just really stiff I think it's swollen so I didn't go walking this afternoon when I when we got home from cheer and I'm not gonna go walking tomorrow I'm just gonna let it like chill for a bit and then um, but next week we have lots of she has her other cheer squad starting up again what's the second one though what do you mean the second one? I don't know what the second one is. There's another <laughs> package coming. Lynn sent another package. I don't know what the other one is. That one is a surprise. So, but there yeah. is another package from Lynn coming for her, but I don't, she's sending it to our store. Is it the sweatshirt? This has taken uh, about a week and a half to get to us. So, she kind of was yeah. like, I'll just send it to the store um, in hopes that it'll get to you sooner. So, should we go home? Also, in the back seat here, we have uh, probably 130 now uh, goodie bags. Oh, you want to show them? This stuff. 
some of them are snacks. She had extra snacks. But my... Should I open one? No, no, no. You can see what's in it. So, one of our amazing cheer moms, um, her daughter was on Ashley's competitive squad. We went to Japan with them. We've gotten to know them um, and become good friends with them. She's an amazing cheer mom, I will say. And when we started, you have to give gifts, little goodie bags, to the other Which team. Which we didn't give one to the other team. Um, yeah, the other team didn't know about it today, and so they didn't have I a I think the bag. coaches just didn't want to do it. Yeah. Because they're so young. And okay, like, let me explain. So, you're supposed, the team is supposed to go and give a cheer bag, a little goodie bag to the other team as camaraderie, get to know the other team, just say hi, that kind of thing, so that there's no animosity between the teams. Um, and we've done this, this is our third year doing it, so the other mom, um, she's like, you know what, let's just make this easy and not have to make these new bags every single week and assign it out every single week. So she hopped on Amazon and added up all these different trinkets and pieces of candy to go into these bags. And she also ordered the bags. Um, you can tell what's in the bag in just a second. Um, she added it all up and she told all the moms in a message, if you'll pay me 20 bucks, I will order all these things and me and my sister will put all the kits together and we'll be done for the entire season. And everyone's like, here's my $20, Venmo, ka-ching. <laughs> like we were all, every single mother was like, hands down yes. So tell them what's in this little goodie bag. So can I just like open the music? Yeah, right. you can. Yeah, um, you can show them. She thought of really good ideas. So there's a little cheer bracelet that says, tie the bracelet on your wrist close Close your eyes, make a wish. When the bracelet breaks into two, the wish may will be made true. So you all just super like, cute little cheer bracelet. Um. Oh, this is isn't that cute. I wish we had these actual bows. It's a keychain. Look at it. Turn it around. It's a keychain. Or a little, uh, you know, clips onto your bag. I already your have backpack. one of these. I want one. It's of, super cute. One. I really want another one. I just but want black would be, um, we did a purple. Um, There's more. No, I know. We did the purple bracelet, but she wanted the rest of the things to kind of be generic no matter what team. Um, then there's a little lip balm. A little lip balm. Okay. And then a little lollipop, high chews, and gummies. Little candies. So we appreciate all her work to put those together. Um, so the girls were able to go and take those to the other cheerleading squad. We like have to throw them up to them because they were like not coming down. Oh, and they were like... Because they, they just didn't, I think they just didn't know. Oh. So... Anyway, fun day at cheer today, but I've got all the extras. Um, I'm gonna keep at my house. We have the roster numbers for each of the squads, so based on what game we're going to, we will take those each time. That kind and of the main stuff. yeah, so we're gonna go home and crawl back into bed. <laughs> She's gonna take a shower. She fell asleep with her cheer hair still in a ponytail. I fell asleep two days in a row for that. Yeah, she was out. I mean, she got everything else. She got ready for bed, but my I did not go to sleep last night. My hair was still intact because I did not. Yeah, go to sleep. she was, but she brushed her teeth, had her medicine, got into bed, got into pajamas. She just didn't get as far as her hair before she passed out. I don't think you thought you would actually go to sleep. You just were exhausted from my, last night. Yeah, you didn't even get on Facetime calls with your friends. I will never do that at 10 p.m. at you night. You are always doing no, that at 10 p.m. I don't know. Okay, Ash, what are we doing? I'm putting the Nike logo on, but I don't know if I want, like, Nike or if That's I kind of big. Blue Just, do Just do bluey. Just bluey? Just do bluey, because otherwise it's really big. Yeah. I want it on the pocket. Yeah? Yeah. That looks cute. All that noise is from your iPad. Cause she's like spam jumping on a game. How much do you have to do it for? Well, these are 30 seconds, but these are a little harder cause they're thicker. So I'm gonna do like a minute or something. Okay. I'm gonna like take it off. Yeah. The last stayed on pretty good. Okay Ash, show the final product. And that noise is Willa. Willa. Say hi, Willa. Hi. <laughs> okay, come up close. That is really cute. It's 
it's really I, cute. The Nike letters were too big. It like went down to here. Oh, okay. You want you didn't want it that low. Well, we'll save the Nike letters for another sweatshirt. That'd be cute. But no, blue really one. <laughs> yeah, the colors were off too. Yeah, it was like a darker shade. Darker this, shade but. than the bluey blue. All right, you like it? Yeah. You want to tell Lynn thank, thank you? Thank you. Yep, very sweet of her to send that to you. All right, I, it's actually been, we're combining a couple days here. <laughs> because she wasn't feeling good the day we got the bluey patch and then I wasn't feeling good. I don't even know what day it is anymore. It's Sunday. When did we get the pants? I think I went out and got the pants. When I went out one last night, I don't remember. But anyway, she um, got that all put on there today. Today's Sunday. Um, but I am here on the couch in my room. And I'm watching The Perfect Couple on Netflix. I haven't like sat and watched like Netflix in so long. And we have just decided that we all needed like a nothing day today. We didn't go to church because it, anyway, it's a thing. <laughs> so we didn't go to church. It was state conference. It's a conference that our, our general area does twice a year. Um, and that's what the today was. So we didn't have ch church. We all slept in. Um, I have like my Sunday headache. So I'm just chilling i can hear dot out there she can probably hear me talking she doesn't like when she can hear people inside talking um but anyway um so i've just been resting and editing and now i'm watching a show guilt-free i'm truly enjoying my time here in my room i was gonna watch the seahawks game but when i looked up the time instead of looking at my stupid magnet that I have on my fridge I asked Surrey stupidly and it gave me the final score from the for the game that had already happened today <laughs> it's like, I can't watch games when I already know the end result of the game so did not have a Seahawk game to watch so that's why I decided to come up and watch Netflix instead so I'm gonna sign off with you guys I don't know if this is a short video I haven't edited the first part of it with Ashley quite yet but thank you for always thinking of our girls and the fun little things that you can do for them I think that's really really special um so thank you thank you for sending that to her made her day when she kind of has not felt so good so uh but we did have a really good weekend like all of her games I just finished editing the high school game and it was so much fun it was so much fun. Um, but one thing I didn't preface in that video, and I didn't really want to take away from like the performances and stuff as I, as I was editing, I didn't really want to put in anything, but I, I couldn't show Ashley actually dancing and performing because they have very strict rules at the high school, all very justified, I will say, for security reasons. Only certain people are allowed down on the track behind the football players. And so um, we were given special permission as coaches to be there, but we were given very specific locations that we could be in. So only like three or four coaches could go down on the other side of the cheerleaders, like where Ashley was. And by the time I realized that we could have some down there, there was already enough down there. And I, they had already started performing, so they were like blocking off that area from me being able to go down there. And I was so bummed because that's where Ashley was, and I would have had a, a literal like line sight of her. <laughs> so, and Jason, from where he was sitting in the stands, um, he had a better shot of her, but he just doesn't think to <laughs> film her, and only got one video of her. So, um. And by the time I realized he had even that one video, I had already edited and uploaded the video. So I don't have anything. Um, so that's why you didn't really see her very much. Um, we had to just kind of abide by all the rules of the high school in order to be there and not, you know, have that opportunity taken away from us in the future. But now I know in the future, 
that I need to find out where Ashley is going to be standing and I will go to that location right off the bat. So, um, plus there's a lot of confusion of us and when the girls are supposed to go onto the field to get their recognition, I think I mentioned that. It all just happened so fast and the communication was so difficult to know where we were supposed to be and when. And so, anyway, it is what it is. We learned and hopefully we get it the invite to come back next year. Um, I think it's really fun, fun to do. And I was talking to, um, the head coach for the high school cheerleaders, as well as the choreographer that we use. Um, she's the high school choreographer as well as ours. Um, I was talking to both of them throughout the game and I was like, dude, you can see on the eighth grade girls faces, you can see on their face the spark that they have. Like, if I keep working hard this year, I could be those cheerleaders next year at the high school. And the head coach, she was like, yes, you are correct. She was like, it hits them in their eighth grade year. And when we give them this opportunity to come to the high school, it really sparks something in them. And that's why she said, that's why I give you as many tools as coaches um, to prepare them to be able to try out and get onto the high school team. She's like, I'm going to be sending you guys um, video after video after video of the th and lists of things that they need to be working on this year. And this is for the eighth graders. But it also, she's like, but I'm going to say like, you know, she pointed at me. She's like, your daughter is in sixth grade, but like, you might as well have her start practicing now and start knowing what she is expected of her at the high school level. Cause she'll have a higher chance of being able to get onto the squad. Cause they only have 28 girls that are on their squad total. And so not, not a lot will make it. So <laughs> it's just, it was really fun. So we had a good weekend, but we're all just resting and relaxing today and yesterday afternoon. So um, thanks for joining us and we will see you guys next time.